I was born in Berlin in 1928. My childhood was peaceful until the war started. We lost our farm to air raids and my father to the draft. My mother and I fled to Bavaria where my uncle owned a camera shop. The American GIs would come in to order prints of photos they took. And they took a lot of photos. An American soldier named Leo became a fixture in the shop. We really liked having him around. Leo and I became very good friends. My mother invited Leo over for dinner and he helped us make our modest meal. Evergreen needle and flour soup with butter and cheese. No bread. Leo was a good sport. He really enjoyed it. After Leo's commission was over, he returned to America to study at university. I missed him, but never thought of falling in love with an American boy. I received my first letter from him after six weeks, and we quickly became pen pals. I told Leo how our neighbors had received care packages and how much we needed supplies and food. It was $10 to send a package, and in those days, that was a huge amount of money. But Leo knew how hard our lives were and scrimped and saved to send us a package. Opening the package was an adventure. Cocoa, packs of cigarettes, coffee, like Christmas. Leo sent us many packages and soon asked me to join him in America. There was a mountain of paperwork. They didn't want American boys to marry the enemy and made it as hard as possible. But I made it to America. And on August 7, 1948, we got married. I'm Leo Kissel. I'm Helga K. Kissel. And we're here in Colorado Springs to reminisce about the good old days. Here.